this uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Before I dance my daughter, I have a message for her and to everyone. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I would like first to thank you all for coming to my daughter's 18th birthday tonight. Almost six months ago, when Joyce asked me and my wife if she can have a birthday party. To be honest with you, I was shocked. <laughs> and I told her, okay, that's fine. We will, we will give you the best party, which is, it's up to you guys to see if it's the best party. And I walk into the room, I was shaken and nervous. Not because I don't have the resources to give to her the birthday party, but due to the time frame preparation and my ever increasing age, <laughs> I forgot to organize the party in the first place like this. My second thank you comes to my loving wife, Jocelyn, for always remembering to do things that I forget. Preparing this event and being sure that I will agree to whatever she prepares for this party. A great mother to our child, Joyce. And a big thank you to my family and my friends here in Florida, from all over the world, from the Philippines, Singapore, Canada, who came here and help us, plus my relatives in California, Maryland, and friends in New York. Thank you very much for coming here. A big thank you. But on a serious note now, Joyce, as you turn 18, a milestone in your life has come, and as, our par as your parents, to see how you grow to be a beautiful child. <laughs> and fragile, fragile child, first, the first time I saw you in the hospital, 18 years ago. To be a strong and independent daughter that stands before us now, oh, you're sitting, sorry. You're a smart, beautiful, and I'm very worried one day you will bring a boyfriend to our house. <laughs> but we are all here today, your family and your friends, to say we all love you and may your happiness in whatever do you do you next. Lastly, it's a novella. But really, you have filled our lives with happiness that cannot be measured by any scale in any man has. So good luck in your life with your boyfriend, whoever, but husband. <laughs> I hope that one day your children will bring you as much happiness as you have brought to us, to your family. Just remember this, be happy and reach for the moon. If you miss it, you will land the stars and be the brightest we can see. I love you.